Hello everyone! If it's alright, then you can hear me and see something in the screen. I need to find myself to read the comments. It's almost there. It's loading, but hi everyone. Uh, I see a lot of people coming in. So good to see. I see that on my phone, but not on my iPad. So let's see, let's see. What's wrong? It's still loading and if it doesn't work on my iPad I will do it another way well hi everyone I have another thing next to me where I can read your comments but it's the screen is a little bit smaller so I will try again on my iPad well it's good to see that are so many of you are here uh, so welcome at this Facebook live so tonight I do the live uh, because Alice is traveling to the Netherlands and she's boarding now so um, then she can do a live um, so I'm here tonight and um, it will be a little bit uh, Christmas tonight. So uh, some people of you maybe are starting with Christmas card. Um, so uh, I will do that tonight with the food truck and a lot of good dyes from uh, Josette. It's all Josette uh, dyes what I'm using tonight. So that's, um, yeah, I like that. I'm still searching for my Facebook. That doesn't work. Hi, anytime. Yes, you can like, comment and share this video. And then uh, you make a chance for a uh, gift card from $50. Next Monday, the uh, next winner will be announced. Um, let's see. So, I prepared something for tonight because I prepared a lot. And maybe I don't use everything, but if you look at this, I am really happy when I see this. And I like to make these trays and just, I laid it here for a few days and I was very happy to see every time when I look at this, I say, yeah, I like that. <laughs> so, um, yeah, just making some embellishments and... Yes, it works on my iPad, finally. Um, so, um, but tonight I have oh, um, a sneak peek for the new collection from Josette. Because, uh, let me say if I'm correct. No, not a monster truck. Just a normal truck. A Christmas truck. Um, let's see... So, do, 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 do. Monday, the next release from Josette uh, is there, and it is a great release. Um, I love it, and I think you will love it too. Um, and I can show you a little sneak peek, and I'm also working with it tonight so um, I think that's fun um, <laughs> yeah it looks like a uh, monster truck yes um, so let's start because uh, I have a lot to do tonight 
and my idea for tonight is just making the food truck and I have a plan in my head for the uh, Christmas season to make more food trucks and then um, how do I say that mm -mm -mm. Fenster bank in het Engels I don't know, Fensterbank. Geen idee. I don't know what was in English. But then um, I will make a scenery with food trucks and maybe some houses. So um, it's a Christmas scenery. Um, so this is one of the food trucks I will uh, use. And probably there will be much more other stuff. But that means that I will make it a little bit 3D. So... Um, and else same, I'm doing the live together, else, so not uh, I, Sanna, but else and Anita are Monday here for uh, a live. And that will be fun and I'm pretty sure we will have lots of fun and need more time than an hour. Yes, of course, uh, more than one hour. Um, so that will be fun too. So Monday you can check that out too. Um, and they go live with the new release of Josette and next Wednesday I am again live also with the new collection of from Josette but then in a different way so that's next week um, tonight the food truck I have a lot of elements uh, for Christmas but first um, the food truck Um, I prepared some stuff because uh, it is a lot. Well, I will lay it in screen. I've prepared a lot of stuff for tonight. Just all these trays makes me so happy. So I just, uh, most of the part, I dark it with uh, soft finish cardstock and uh, color that with distress ink. But some parts are with uh, design paper. Then here are some parts. And here. So this is what I prepared. And I will use a lot. But I don't know if I use everything. But first the food truck. This will be in here. Um, the food truck is a beautiful kit you can make. It. It's a kit with... A die from the food truck, and there is another set there with elements you can use. So, with a hamburger, with a donut, with drinks, ice cream, fries. So, um, this, these are two sets, but these are great to combine together, but you can also use them separately. Um, food truck I will use all the dyes uh, tonight and from the accessory set uh, some parts yes I'm very happy with that uh, with the tints um, so um, for tonight I need glue um, you can do this like you want because some people like to color everything with distress ink with uh, with watercolor, with from uh, design paper, from cardstock, it is what you want. Uh, so don't uh, feel the need to do it the same way. And maybe you see a lot this life. I can understand that, but try to pick these things that works for you and that you have. And maybe we have other dyes. That take, oh, this is fun too. Do that. I will put that here. And then the lamp. And I try to read the comments, but um, sorry if I don't read everything. And please ask again or uh, something. Yes, just making the tr uh, uh, trays, that's just a lot of fun.
Then I use the kitchen die, and a lot of the kitchen die I use tonight. Oh no, not this time. So this is the bag you can use for the kitchen. This is the kitchen, and you can use this as wall. I use it as bag in my uh, food truck, so it looks a little bit, a bit like a kitchen in a food truck. And I also use this piece to hang on the pans and the mixer. So, but before I tie this together, I have to think about what I want behi um, behind the food truck. Because this part, this rail, I think, is for behind. Uh, so it's in the food truck. It looks like it's in the food truck. So you want that behind this. If you add higher these, this wall uh, straight to the food truck you can put things between the layers so first I call it pan and oven wand and this one and I will glue that down Yes, the food truck is absolutely awesome. And you can do a lot of fun things with it. So just a small drop of glue. And just to give it a little bit more color, I do this in red. And then put that between these two because they have the same color. Um, that is, um, yeah, I like to do the same colors a little bit. But that red will make the difference a little bit. So like that. So that will come at the wall. Like this. A little bit higher, I see. Then I have also prepared... Let's see why I have it. <laughs> um, a cake. And I thought maybe it's fun to put that here in front a little bit. So I just like to play with that. That looks fun. And of course I will decorate everything with these Christmas branches and uh, everything. But that will be at the end. Uh, those little accessories are adorable for that. Yes, absolutely. Yes. So I can... Tie this here. Like that. Yes, that's great. Um, can I do more? So this uh, makes me... Uh, different layers so it gives you depth um, when you put this in front and that behind it gives different layers so I like that um, bum, bum, bum. I think I can hide that together can I? <laughs> just thinking this one needs to be here No, not because I have some socks that I want here, but I need to see if that is 
too much. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> and then skate can be in front. Yes. So I um, make these socks from the cozy fireplace. And I also use the branches of this set. Um, this is the latest release from Joseph. From Christmas, last Christmas. And in different sets there are different branches, so you can use different uh, smaller and bigger ones. And I like that uh, difference because when you are in front, uh, you can choose the bigger ones and at the back the smaller ones. So you uh, get the depth too. And this. So I think this is good for now, so we can adhere that. And I will do that with some tape. Let's see. So I when I prepared this, I so I had in my if I had an idea in my head from a movie I saw that's the uh ooh, what is it called? I really like that movie. I've watched it I've watched it a lot of times. Um, it's with Vanessa Hutchins and at night and they um all prepared in a Christmas town looks like but I've watched a lot of Christmas movies and I like that uh, the things when cities are turned into Christmas and uh, yeah that's a lot of fun I think Yeah, I don't know now. Uh, nights, it's not night, night, nights, glitter, but I don't know. And now I need to hide this one. So this little sneak, this paper, because this paper is from the new paper pack from Yosette. And I will show it soon. So I will show this live, the whole paper pad to you. But this is one piece of the paper pad. And it's a beautiful color for Christmas. Yes, after the live. Yeah, I will search after the live. Because I can't uh, deal with that, that I don't know it. So, I make this a little bit 3D too. Just by putting a tape here and fold these lines. So like that. I need to turn it a little bit. That so now I can put this frame over top of it. Yes. 
Yes, night before Christmas. That's it. Yes. Oh, I see else. Yeah, I don't. I forgot the name. Angelique, Angelica Turner made this design papier for you. Said there are two paper packs. So um, when I'm finished the food truck, then I will show it, and then I will go further to decorate everything. Okay. But believe us, the paper pet is great. So, there you go. The food truck. Doesn't it look cute? Um, so, the cake is in front of the socks. And maybe you saw it, but this also from new paper pad from Josette. So, then the wheels. Yes, it's a lot of fun I had. Because I go through my dice, I have a uh, car where all my dice in. And then I go through these dice like, oh that's fun, oh that's fun too, oh that's fun too. So, yeah, it's an endless thing because I really like a lot of these dice, especially when it goes about Christmas. Can be. Uh, this paper, I see a question about the paper. Uh, This paper, yeah, it's not designed from your set, but it will be, uh, it comes with the collection of your set. So Monday, the new collection of your set is there, also with the paper pads, um, designed by Angelica Turner. Um, then. Every time I have to think. The other way. And then these small elements. Oh, I'm so happy with this food truck. So can you, can you imagine that you make a whole scenery uh, in front of your window with some lights maybe. I have some tiny lights here. That will be really awesome with some uh, snow. over there so it looks a little bit like christmas huh but there will become a lot more decoration for christmas because this is not enough christmas for me but i'm almost done with the base so then i can show you the paper pad first and then we go further to decorate So this part is white because I will do something with that later. Yeah, never enough Christmas for me. There's some glue at the front so I can put that here. Then this one to scream that's Christmas time. Then this grip to make the door open. Uh, let's see here. And as you can see, it's great to um, mix with inking and using design paper. So um, that makes it a little bit easy that you don't have to color everything. 
this card. Hi everyone, welcome to this live. So, this is it for the base. Are you ready for the design paper? The new design paper, who is released at next Monday. Um, so there are two paper pads. Designed by Angie Turner. The first one is the Pretty Pestles. So this paper pad is uh, sized by 12 inch by 12 inch or 30 and a half centimeters by 30 and a half. It's 12 double sided sheets with 24 designs and one uh, cover. So this one. There will be two of these, uh, only this paper because you have the front. Um, so this is the first one, Pretty Pestles. I'm not done, Femke. I just did the base, and now after I'm showing this paper, I will do the decorating. Um, so the next one is Beautiful Bright. And these are brighter colors, as the name said. It's the same. It's 12 by 12 inch, 12 double-sided cheese, 24 designs. Um, and I will go through these paper pads with you. First, I show you the pretty pestles. So it all has a different design. And I think I can lay it better over here. So, blue. Put some lighter blue. Yeah, and I have got some papers because I use it. Here are some uh, branches with green. And a brighter green. Some blue, greenish. And this one. So I go a little bit fast through these papers because I know else will work with it Monday too. And um, I will show it next Wednesday again. So uh, you can see it a lot. Beautiful purple. Yes, it's great for backgrounds and also for die cutting uh, uh, fig uh, figures of uh, Josette dies or with the planner or yeah, everything. You can use it. Uh, for everything. And I really loved it. And it's not um, too much because this is really, yeah, I like this. Yeah, I will need a lot of those. <laughs> yeah, I can understand. <laughs> it's really beautiful paper. So that's almost one paper pad with beautiful designs. Yes, it's uh, really great to work with it. So that was the pretty pestles. Now we go on to the beautiful brides. So I think you will see the difference when I show this. So this is a lot brighter, but it's great for Christmas from the new release that is coming. <laughs> but I can tell what it is. Can't tell you what it is. But Understand me? It's great. Um, it will be available in the US, but else 
told me something about that. I will look at that. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Um, the paper is in Europe uh, available uh, Tuesday, but from the US it will be a little bit later. Um, so you have a little bit to wait, but it's definitely worth it to wait for. So, the beautiful brides. And they are really bright and they are really, really lovely. And can you imagine that this is great for Christmas? And I use this paper for this life. So I will come back with that later. And I will go a little bit faster through this because we need a lot to do for this life. But this is also great for uh, making small elements at your um, uh, planner page. Maybe some tab that brings the color more uh, above and it gives the focus on your uh, page or your card. So it don't have, don't have to be a whole page. It can be, but you can also use this for small elements. So, I really love it. I uh, see a lot of good comments. So, uh, that will be great. And also this for uh, Halloween. Beautiful. And that orange for pumpkins. I really, really love it. So yeah, beautiful stuff is coming to you and more will come Monday. Because Anita and Els have to do something too. <laughs> so they will show you a lot of fun stuff in life from Monday. So these are the two paper packs. Now we go back to the food truck. Because we made the food truck. And now we need to decorate. So um, I made these tables. And I made two of them. And add higher the top together so they can stand. And I need to die cut another foot trick so they can uh, I can make them stand too. Because I think that's fun. Or I need to make a background after it. Um, so I made two tables and two of these. Yes, Christmas gifts. Yes, absolutely. It's used for everything. So I put this here in the middle. And also at the other table. So now you can see this color is, looks like Christmas for me. And then for these tables, I made a cute thing. And that are these candle lights. These from, let me see. From the... Oh, from the fireplace. So here are the candle lights, and I add some tiny branches from another set. So the tiny branches are in the Let's Bake set. So from this set, I use a lot of things, such as the cake, uh, the branches, also this piece. Uh, this piece is for um, rolling to make cookies. I don't know, dough, dough, dough is it called. But I use this as a plate, a serving plate. So the gnome, work I made, can hold some glass of drinks. But this tiny element is so cute. I like to make this. 
it's just so tiny but i really love it and i put this as decoration at the table Isn't that cute? I will take a seat if I saw so they were like this. Um, so then we need to decorate the truck further. Um, if you have the die of the holiday train then there are some it's a dye you can make snow or smoke with it and I use it as snow at the top of the food truck and I will show you how I do that so there are parts with four and with three and then you can lay the on each other and make a line of it. So let's see. And it fits perfectly at the top. So it looks like snow. So let's decorate your food truck. Yeah, I uh, thought that also I want to build it higher. Um, so just one circle is on every top. So then here, put another glue dot. And here, um, let's do two of them, one here. And one like this. So then it is enough to put this over here. So I put some glue at this top. Oh, this looks so much fun. I like this. Um, is the stuck selling food or food in the... I don't know yet, Femke. Um, so, that's enough. Then I have these two. And these two are from the Holiday Train set. So these are that uh, red white candy and I lay them to each other so I can put that over the wheels. So it's looks a little bit more like Christmas um, then I 
have these cookies. We got this one to be on top because that's a large cookie, so you can see it. And this one, I thought it's fun to put them a little bit behind, so it's sticking out of the. Let me see. Yes, that will be it. It's decorating time. And then let's see. I can put some branches here with some cherries. Another one. Yes, the uh, gingerbread man can also be here. That was also be fun. Just one more. Can you understand why I love this? It's so much fun to do this. Just go through your dice and watch. And then I think this is enough from now for here. Then I have those lights. I want to put it here. And these are from the train cards. The train cards, and I also use this candy and these branches. And these lights are um, two dice so the baits and the lights. So now I have a question for you. Who are who is planning to make these food truck too? Or Christmas scenery? Oh, I love it. So I have some small branches. I thought maybe that's fun on the cake. But I also have these parts. And these are in the uh, holiday train set. So you can decorate um, these top. But I like to decorate um, these cake with it. So I have gold, white and red. Maybe I put on top a branch. 
No, that's too much. Like that. Then I plan to make a gnome. So I'll put this here. Uh, if you saw this view, I will make a picture after the live, but this is how I liked it so much. Um, the gnome. Uh, let me see which one do I make. I prepared three, so I need to uh, choose this one. The girl. Um, I need to make the eyes and some dyes from you that are with dyes for the eyes but this one is not so you need to color it but that's just a little small circle Yes, I will decorate the food truck further with some branches. I will do that after I do this. So. No. First I thought I will do the holiday elf. But I make a lot of elves. And I thought gnomes are also cute. And the elves are a little bit bigger than the gnomes. So this, these are really cute for everything because the gnomes are also perfect for your planner or your card or whatever you make. Hey David, nice to see you. I'm in a Christmas mood, are you too? Yeah, she's cute, are huh, the gnomes? <laughs> I am as well. <laughs> I thought so. <laughs> then this arm. So there are two arms. One who is holding something you can hold gift to something in the arms and one who's at the back so this one is for at her back And the hands, or oh, one hand. And then I give her a plate. Um, let's see. Where do I have that? Somewhere. I prepared the plate. Where do I have that? How can I miss that? 
I prepared so much that I'm don't know where it is. And it's a really small element, so <laughs> now. Nah. Where oh here. Ha, here it is. Yeah, see you Sunday, David. Bye bye. Um, no, I will not watch it tonight, maybe tomorrow. <laughs> um, so I give her this plate, and then she can hold some drinks so she can bring that to the people. Then this one here. And there. So this can be away. So one tray is empty. <laughs> one of the, I don't know how much. And shoes. And then I have, of course, some drinks from the food truck accessory kit. Looks like fun, right? That ball at her head, and then a heart. Yeah, so this tray is from the what did I say? From the Let's Bake. So it's that piece piece when you roll in the dough, and um, you can make it as plate. Oh, you can use this die that you can hold it so that's uh, yeah I like that so that's the gnome um, then I have some board and I have some presents um, so these are the sentiments from the um, kitchen um, Release from your set, and I saw a cinnamon this holiday treats, and it will fit on the board. Uh, do we have a tiny mug guy? I don't know yet. Uh, oh, I don't need the whole stem. Uh, because this is a smaller board, I use I stem two times, but I don't need to ink everything. So first I will stamp holiday. And then I will stamp treats. So, um, you can use the, use the word separately, um, instead you need, you don't need to cut everything, of, but just stamp in two times. Holiday treats. So, I have a lot of decoration left, so maybe we can put that over here. Um, 
or maybe a holy branch. Or a small mistletoe. No. I just need a smaller one. Yeah, this is better. Like this, and then some. There we And then I will cut this away. Yeah, like that. Um, so. I have enough left over, but I can use that. Um, of course, I will make two more gnomes too, but this will be a big project um, for Christmas. So I will show every when I have something new. I will show that, of course. But we can decorate the bus of the food truck a little bit more. Mm, let's see. I can put this here too. Yes. I can't stop, can you see it? <laughs> so much fun to play, but it, I know it's almost time. Almost. Show this to yourself at Christmas in your own classroom. Oh yeah, that would be great too. I have a... Uh, in my class I have a... Place where are some lights from above. And it's just one square. So I can put things in there. That would be great. Oh, good idea. So, I thought maybe it's fun to decorate with these branches at this line. And of course, here in the middle, we can do that too. First in the middle. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. It's so much fun to do this. Then I will put some. There are also um, my berries um, with one berry, so you can add these two. Yes, glitter will also be perfect. Yeah, but if I have to do that, also I don't have time enough for this life. So um, I thought this is enough for different things. That I show. Let me see. This can also be here. Let's 
see if I have some. No, this is better. Da -da -da -da. Just gluing, don't think too much. And some berries. And then I'm done for tonight. And I will show everything that I made tonight. And of course I will work further at this food truck. Christmas thing. Should I do some of that there? Let's see. No, that's too much. So I think this is it for now. But I will save these parts because we can use them, of course, for the other things um, so what I made tonight is this this food truck with this underneath the food truck I made these tables I made these Work with sentiment and this gnome and the idea is to make a whole scenery with food trucks and maybe some houses for Christmas so um, yeah a lot of ideas a lot of stuff left over to use um, but for now I will thank you so much Monday will be a fun day because Anita and Els are here to do a live with a new collection from Josette and a new design paper uh, designed by Angelica Turner with Fritz Perfect with the uh, uh, collection of Josette. And next Wednesday I am back again with the new collection of Josette. Um, so thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun. And um, yeah. If you have made some Christmas uh, food trucks or things. Please show it. Um, that will be a lot of fun. Uh, have a great weekend. Uh, no it's not a weekend. It's Wednesday. Have a great day or evening and see you next time. Bye-bye.